What's up everybody, Sebastian here, back in Belgium, and yeah, so basically like, this is the bike I use riding in Belgium, basically like, it's not the best, I have a better one at the sea, this is like one like, it costs like 60 euros, so like I just got it second hand, and yeah, so I'm gonna be riding my bike on the Belgian roads, and tell you how I feel, my thoughts, my emotions, my struggles I'm facing, and yeah, and it's pretty nice, like, it's pretty hot today, beautiful weather, and I figured like, I mean, what else is there to do than ride a bike, you know, like, so yeah, let's go, so, right now, I'm riding the bike, down the road! Okay, so this is like the neighborhood in Belgium where I live with my sister. We have a house. And yeah, it's like just amazing. Um, so... This can be like an uncut video, like my other ones, like that, you know. So basically... You might be wondering, what did I do in Belgium when I arrived? So, the first thing what I did is, I practiced driving manual and automatic. So it's like, you know, here in Belgium, like, there's this, like, manual, you know, manual. And it's like, it, I tried driving for the first time manual, and it definitely came with its own challenges. Like, especially when you need to stop, and like, <laughs> you know, shift gear fast, and it's like, you know, it's like sometimes like when I was driving the manual, then what happened was like, I, like with manual, like you need to like, before red light, and you, let's say you had sixth gear, like you need to downshift to fifth, and fourth, and then third, and then second, and then first, and then you come to a complete stop, you know. And it's like sometimes it's a bit challenging because like you can't push the clutch and the accelerator at the same time. So it's like I definitely like had some challenges there, but like overall like I'm coming pretty constant driving like in Belgium, you know. Um, and basically, wait, I, would, I just went to a red light. Yeah. But basically, it's like you know I'm pretty, I'm getting pretty constant on the Belgian roads, you know. Like, they're pretty small, like, the difference in America. Um, sometimes, like, you, it's like, you, this stuff to remember, like, priority, who has priority and stuff. But, I mean, you know, I mean, it's doing all right, you know. So, until now, I have about maybe, how much driving hours? Maybe, like, 10 driving hours, you know? And, you know, I'm getting there, you know? But it's pretty fun, like, I I haven't driven solo yet. But that will come soon. Um, so, yeah. Let's just go here to the neighborhood and see where it takes me. Um, so what else? The weather today, very, very sunny. Like, really, really sunny. And it's like... It's like, you know, it's like 25 degree, which isn't that bad. I realized when I arrived in Belgium here, it's like... Wait, there's someone behind me, wait. I realized when I arrived in Belgium, that the weather here, is like there's more wind. And it's like slightly a bit colder, you know? And it's like, in Spain there was like this very, very, very hot breeze like like when I was riding like it was like hot here and here it's like it's nice and cool you know usually I'm not allowed to do this don't do this but yeah it's like to be honest I've never came here to like a bad this is so annoying I'm not I didn't bear I haven't been gone in this neighborhood I'm filming while riding my bike it's just so fun Of, like, I mean, I kind of regret not staying long in that host family, like, you know, it's like, like, 
I had promised my friends that I'd go to the bed and coast, you know, but it's like, I wouldn't mind, I wouldn't have minded staying another month in a family, to be honest. I mean, it would have been way better because, like, you know, it was like always the same routine year by year by year. And it's like, for me, like, change is very, very important, you know. Change is very, very important in life. <laughs> like, how boring is life without change? Like, I can just imagine, like, staying in the same location for the next 30 years. It's, like, just boring, you know? Like, we need change in life. We need change. Why am I going on this? I've never been here, I literally never been to this world. Change is probably so important in life. So, so important. You know? So, yeah, seek change, you know. But we really love it. Oh shoot, I'm not in a home anymore. Doors. I don't want to get hit by a car. You know, it's like I am dwelling on the main road. Don't get hit by a car. Let's do the ride about the only way on the ride about. Make sure there's no one coming. There's no one coming, good. No one coming, dear. Go fast. Go fast, go fast, go fast, go fast. Before someone comes. This is fun. Gosh, I, li I literally, I never came here. <laughs> I'm like, screw it. Let's go on an adventure. I never came here. <laughs> we have this tape. I have no idea what this is. <laughs> Take me. But I didn't realize the words here. Like, they're pretty small compared to the American ones. Like, this here is one lane. Like, I mean, two lanes, you know? Sometimes in bedroom when you drive, it's like, you would think it's one, it's like, one lane, but in reality, it's two lanes. Like, roads are very narrow here. <sighs> oh, shoot, man. Where the hell am I going? That's Bonnert. I hope I have to be G on my phone. Let's go to... Let's go in... Yeah. Let's see what it says. But I really think... I'm gonna head to America soon. Um, I don't know, like, it's hard deciding where, but it's like either New York, Florida, or Phoenix. I think it's a thing. It's definitely not easy choosing, like, which place I would like to go to. You know, but I had the decision, like, I'd rather go to flight school in America than um, in Europe because, like, in America, they give me my FAA license, which is like, you can come become an airline pilot in America. And that's what I want, and I want to live in America when I'm older, you know, so, it's like, different those challenges thrown my way, you know. But it's like, you know, I still need to see, you know. Because New York, the weather isn't very good, the year they want to fly. If I go to Florida, I'd be in like very hot weather and like the thunderstorms are brutal in Florida and if I go to Phoenix it'd be deadly hot but very sunny to fly you know 
Oh gosh, let's go up this hill. Ooh. Oh, I don't know, maybe I'll become a pair again in Spain. You know what I think? There's so much stuff to do in life. So, so much. And it's definitely hard to decide which one to take. Wait, let me see where I'm. Where I am, wait. Let me see on Google Maps. If I, if I continue this way, then where will it take me? I'm here. Yeah, I do a tour. Okay, I know where I am. I can think straight. Actually, you know, my they might just have problems. I need to go back. I don't wanna gosh, my GSM had problems today and it's like you know, it had some issues. It like just saw off on me and then I really pushed like ten seconds and it turned back on. So it's like just now like just shot off on me. This is bugging me. Oh shoot, oh my gosh. <laughs> what someone left the book there? Gosh, no, why did my GSM not work? Why? Why? So, wait, wait, so someone left the book there. It is not normal, this is seriously not normal. Shoot. I have to fix my, what happened here? Wait one second. Let me fix my GSM. Let's push ten seconds, both of them. Oh, it turned on again. Oh my gosh. Epic, it turned on. Oh gosh, I'm like after like oh and I see like I recorded thirty minutes, but I say after like ten minutes of writing. I'm already pretty hot, like, don't think, like, it's just Spain boiling hot, like, Spain is hotter, but here, I'm also pretty damn hot, you know. Oh my gosh, it worked. What? It just turned on, and then, wait, this is not normal, wait. This is not normal. Okay, my GSM has problems, shit. Oh, now it works. Check this out. Oh my gosh, I hope it doesn't shut off. Gosh, that was so weird. It's so hot, I'm already sweating. I think I'm gonna go and visit a friend today. I mean, <laughs> I have to wait for my friends. That's the thing, when you commit to uh, an appointment with your friends, like, Weeks in advance, like I'm obliged to come back. I'm obliged to go with them now, you know. I can't like disrespect them and stay there. It's like, you know, it's like Lux the JR. And it's like, Jen, the 24th, I have a meeting with my friend. We go to the big fair in Luxembourg. But just when I do these commitments in the, in the, in the, in the future, it's like, it like limits me a lot, you know. A lot of stuff what I could do, like, had I not done these commitments, I could just stay, you know, do whatever the hell I wanted. Okay, my jet Sam has problems, I need to go charge it. But that's the thing, like, that's one of the reasons I don't commit to relationships, because, like, 
it just take my freedom away, you know. Oh, I have to oh, be home at this time, be home at this time. Don't talk to that person, don't talk to that person. I don't just have time for that. Like, I'm pretty used to living on my own, you know. Living on my own and doing whatever the hell I want, you know. Because, like, just being in a relationship is, like, you know, stress. Okay, so if the sim doesn't work, I guess I'll be heading back now. Unfortunately, this is probably the worst video ever. You know, the worst video ever. I don't even know if I'm gonna upload this video. Like, if I upload this video, I'm like, what the hell? What the hell has my channel turned into? <laughs> I'm like. Ah, oh, shoot. Gotta get my GSM fixed now. Oh, no. This iPhone has been bugging me. I need a new phone. Well, I head home now. Fix this phone thing. Then go and visit my friend. Okay, wait. Let me go oh, shoot. Okay. Oh, shoot. I have to go back. But I don't know, just bad. So it's like boring. You know, seeing the same locations every day. The world is boring, the people are boring, it's just... It's boring here. You know? Just my mode when I'm in bed, I'm, I'm like, mm, kind of like, oh, not again. The same thing again. Oh, that's where they're following you. I have to go down, but yeah. But whatever, you know. Whatever! I mean, at least I'm not in like India or like these other weird countries with all these bombs. You know, so it's like, I guess it's not that bad. I mean, Belgium's not that bad, but it's like, I always compare it so much to like these other countries I've been to. Okay, I have to go second exit because the third exit takes you to Luxembourg. Okay, this is where all hell begins. Shoot, wait. This is really scary. Okay, I need to support this shit. Man, I don't wanna. Wait, let me go. I'm going to safe for well now. I don't wanna. I don't want to get killed by a car now. I'm only 20 years old, I still have my life to live. Oh. Oh, okay, let's go. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. The 
Okay. Oh my gosh, the cost coming there. Okay, let's go. Yes. Oh yes. Uh, we made it, yes. Oh my gosh. Woo! Hell yes. Now I have to go here. Okay, this is the way. I guess I'll just go up here and I'll end the video now because it's 22 minutes long almost so yeah I want to make it correct okay, so I hope you enjoyed my video feel free to drop a like comment subscribe share with your friend if you enjoyed and peace out